Nasdaq, 100 futures rose on Wednesday evening as Wall Street assessed the latest quarterly results from market bellwether NVIDIA. Nasdaq, 100 futures jumped 0.4%, while S&P 500 futures added 0.2%. Futures tied to the Dow Jones Industrial Average dipped 53 points, or 0.1%. Chipmaker and artificial intelligence darling NVIDIA added 6% in extended trading, sending shares above $1,000, after posting stronger-than-expected fiscal first-quarter results and announcing a 10-4-1 stock split. NVIDIA's fiscal second-quarter revenue guidance of about $28 billion also beat a street account forecast of $36.2 billion, a sign the company doesn't see its momentum slowing. Snowflake added 4% on a revenue beat. NVIDIA's results have been a focal point for Wall Street, as traders hoped for signs that the excitement around AI is not waning. With its $2.3 trillion market cap, NVIDIA also has considerable sway over the broad S&P 500. The stock, alongside AI and mega-cap technology peers, has powered the market's gains into 2024, with Wolf Research's Chris Senyak noting that a beat would be a key tailwind for equities overall. Even in the face of huge expectations, the company once again stepped up and delivered, said Ryan Dietrich, chief market strategist at Carson Group. The always important data center revenue was strong, while future revenue was also impressive. Bottom line, the bar was high and cleared it once again. Stocks dropped during Wednesday's session after minutes from the Federal Reserve's May meeting fueled concerns over sticky inflation and fear that the central bank may push off cuts. The 30-stock Dow fell 0.51% for its worst session in May. The S&P 500 dipped 0.27% and the Nasdaq Composite slid 0.18%. The final stage of the first quarter reporting season continues Thursday with results from Ralph Lauren, BJ's Wholesale, Workday, and more. On the economic front, investors await weekly jobless claims and new home sales data for April. Shares of Live Nation Entertainment slid 6% in extended trading after Bloomberg News reported, citing people familiar, that the Department of Justice will sue the ticketing giant for antitrust violations. Remedies that could be on the table include a breakup of Live Nation, sources familiar told Bloomberg. The concert promoter merged with Ticketmaster back in 2010. Earlier this month, Live Nation reported a record first quarter, with revenue climbing to $3.8 billion, up 21% from the year-ago period. NVIDIA shares popped more than 6% to surpass the $1,000 mark for the first time ever during overnight trading, following another robust quarter driven by artificial intelligence strength. The chipmaker posted adjusted earnings of $6.12 per share, surpassing an LSEG estimate of $5.59. Revenue came in at $26.04 billion, and ahead of an estimate of $24.65 billion. The company also offered strong sales guidance, saying that it anticipates sales of $28 billion for the current quarter versus an LSEG estimate of $26.61 billion. NVIDIA also announced a 10, 4, 1 stock split and said that revenue surged 262% year-over-year during the period for a third consecutive quarter of growth exceeding 200%. Nasdaq, 100 futures jumped 0.4%, while S&P 500 futures added 0.2% following a strong report quarterly from chipmaker NVIDIA. Futures tied to the Dow Jones Industrial Average dipped 50 points, or 0.1%.